Let me summarize what we've covered in this lecture. Political philosophy examines philosophical questions about the relations between states and their citizens. And a central question in political philosophy is whether we have an obligation to obey the law. And this is connect connected to the question of whether states are legitimate. Solving the problem of political obligation requires establishing that we have an obligation to obey the law and explaining the grounds of that obligation. And obeying the law is importantly different from complying with the law. Complying with the law is simply doing what the law commands, whereas obeying the law is doing what the law commands because it commands it. Having an obligation to comply with the law merely requires that you have some obligation that's fulfilled by acting in accordance with the law. Having an obligation to obey the law requires that you have an obligation to obey the law because it's the law. There are a number of different possible grounds for political obligation. The first is that the state benefits its citizens. The second is that we've consented to the state. And the third, that we're part of a fair cooperative scheme and that this gives us reasons to obey the law. If the problem of political obligation can't be solved, then philosophical anarchism is true. We don't have an obligation to obey the law. But even if philosophical anarchism is true, we still have many obligations to comply with the law, to do what the law says. We just might not have an obligation to obey the law. It would be true that we should act in accordance with the law, but not because the law commands it. Thank you very much.